Files. Press start to begin. Aloha, everybody, and welcome back to the Super Bonus Round. We are back with more Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth. I am your host, John Mugiwara J. I'm joined as always by my co-host, Chad Peanut. Hey, and we're back from beating up a cop. Yeah, well, that and, um... That wasn't the last thing we did, was it? I think we did that like, two episodes ago. I we beat up... Oh, yeah, and we saved the, we saved the coffee uh, Brewster from uh, being harassed by fans. Mm -hmm. Oh, and we ran into the guy who made the evil Roomba. Oh, yeah, I'm again. Threatening me, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Wild hog. Here we go. And he has a pizza shield with a soda sword. Yeah, oh my god. <laughs> Hypnotizer. Allow me. Essence of the Komaki Pupil. Oh, he tiger dropped him. I can't get over that now. Here we go. If we ever kids had our own kids lopping in the streets. If we ever had our own game awards where we had like most annoying uh, uh, file line of the game, I think that would be your vote for the year. <laughs> I've actually thought about doing that because like a lot more people are doing like their own game awards because they hate the actual game awards. Uh, Wouldn't yeah. it be fun to do like? Well, actually, I thought about doing like a fun little spin on it because like we both love video games and movies and animation and all that. Maybe we do like sort of, sort of a reward ceremony where we re reward our favorite media of the year. Oh, uh, that'd be fun. Like, like if we do best character, best villain, best story, stuff like that. And we all present our own nominees and we all collectively vote. <laughs> And even if the person in the, uh, uh, even if the person that's uh, co-hosting hasn't seen the person that's nominated such thing, has to make, has to make the case why. <laughs> something fun, something th th fun to think about. Maybe we could start it uh, in 2024. Okay. Or 2025. Oh, all right. It is 2024. Yeah. Or like we can like just retain whatever stuff we've absorbed this year and then just put it up for next year or something. Look at outro. Cool. Alright, we have to go to Oh, we're we're actually at the place we need to be. Here we go. I forgot there's an auto recover thing. All right, so we needed to go to the mall and do something. I already I forgot. I think we had to prepare for going into that uh, gang's district. Cutesy doodles. Cutesy doodles. Oh, it looks like beanie. It looks like beanie babies or something. Oh yeah, I know that trend. Um. I was in on it. Oh, really? Yeah, I loved him as a kid. But... I remember my sister was obsessed for a while. Oh my god, you can fight in the mall! Let me in. Ah, the, the true American experience. <laughs> Why is he chirping like a monkey? Here we go. 
Tiger drop. Damn. What's the hold up? Open wide. Get lost. You didn't even you didn't even scrub down. What's scrub down? That's what it does. Got you now. <laughs> he dumps he dumps them in soapy water and just attacks them by scrubbing them. And now he's weak to electric. Oh, that's <laughs> Jesus cure you. Daddy still got it. Okay, so he up a defense lower. <laughs> he sacrifices a shield to boot the uh, mess with his stats, but now he's wide open. Allow me. I love you times a hundred. We should head back to the hotel soon. Oh. The Anaconda Shopping Center. Is this a real mall in uh, Honolulu? I wonder. I. Uh... You said this place was called Anaconda Shopping Center. It's huge. <laughs> well, it is the biggest shopping center in Honolulu. They got plenty, pretty much all you ever need. It's real. Oh, damn. Looked it up. It's real. We should lo uh, load up the supplies before we head to District 5. All right, we have to go and find Chitosa because she stole his passport. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Oh, God, it's the Sujimon Sensei. Do you want me to do the voice? Yeah. Kasuga, aloha. After our last talk, I realized Hawaii's been calling my name. I got something fun to show you. Meet me by the PC shop in the Anaconda Shopping Center. Aloha. It means hello and goodbye, you know. I love how you make it sound like he's masturbating. <laughs> I'm trying to do an impression of Keith Silverstein. <laughs> Who, by the way, if we go to too many games in, uh, up by me, we could meet. <laughs> he's not just the Sujimon Sensei, he's Shido in Persona 5. Oh, wow. You can tell by the way he talks. Oh, my God. <laughs> there he is. is. Yo, Kasuga, aloha. Enjoying some shaved ice. Oh, mommy, what are you doing here? Didn't I tell you? Hawaii hosts a notorious Sujimon tournament. It's a professional obligation that I attend. Make no mistake, that's the only reason I'm here. This is no vacation, my boy. This is entirely in the interest of... Uh, Suji science. This is the guy with the shaved ice. Hell of a tan for a research trip. So, what's the tournament like? In cases such as these, seeing might prove necessary to believing. Hello, me. Okay. Now, do I you know why I was doing the voice like that? Yeah. Oh my God! It's like a fucking. Uh, Hello there. How can I help you? Micro Center. Who's that, Sujiman? Understood. Please take the elevator. That's how I get that stuff, fucking. <laughs> Why is there a hidden elevator behind the graphics card shelf? Oh my fucking god. What the hell? Indeed. You're fucking kidding me. 
the Sujiman Stadium. <laughs> Holy belief. Home of the Sujimi, where rival Sujimon trainers come to compete. Let me guess, there's an Elite Four. Down on who will win. Really, it's not all that dissimilar from underground gambling in Japan. Or a certain popular franchise. Gambling laws. It's ironic. Those restrictions only drive certain kinds to create such remarkable facilities as this. Hawaii has more to it than meets the eye, huh? Of course. The matches are broadcast worldwide on the dark web. The wealthy can watch and gamble at their leisure. Look! There's a match going on right now. What a fight! The challenger Masato is struggling against the mighty discreet force. <laughs> <laughs> this discreet force! Oh, no. Come on, hang in there, buddy! <clears throat> Is that really it? Finish it. Kill him if you want. Ah! Ah! No, buddy! That all you got? Give up yet? <laughs> no. <laughs> I quit. It's over! Like the rest of the foursome, Jack's team of Sujimon remains untouchable! <sighs> This really is the Suji Lee. I couldn't have imagined that this stub story would get more cracked out than it already was. Led by their Sujimon trainer. Victory goes to the trainer who Sujimon defeat their opponents. A three-on-three Sujimon. Twinkly Jim? Classic Sujimon battle. Wait, what? One of the Sujimon shirts says Twinkly Jim. To determine their of course, are the brave adventurers who catch Sujimon, develop their skills, and create a cohesive team. Finally, the trainer commands them in battle and leads them to victory. Oh my that god. So this game has another game <laughs> among another game in it. Street four. And sitting atop that hedonistic foursome, the ultimate Sujimon master, King. King, huh? Look at him. God, he looks like he'd be a Pokemon champion. Oh, no time for that now. The match is starting. Good luck. Thanks. Wait, huh? Good luck doing what? Now we present a rookie match. In the silver corner, a man so saddled with debt, he's resorted to Sujimon battles to stay afloat. Koichi Ideno! And his opponent in the gold corner, the former Yakuza Kum tourist who never stays down! Kum tourist? Well, he did have a condom on his head in episode one. What the hell's going on, Sensei? I'll admit I've always been the type to beg forgiveness than ask permission. You <laughs> <laughs> That's not something you were profess at all. But this is a Sujimon battle, right? Sensei! I haven't got any Sujimon. Worry not, my boy. I've called in some old friends. Here they come now. This is Pokemon Hello, Stadium, Stichibon. You can rent some. <laughs> Fuck this you, game. <laughs> Hi there. Name's Yasuo Sodachi at your service. Wasn't expecting that voice out of him. Dojo, me, his student Karaki. And I'm his most positive and energetic student, Yokawa. Who the hell are these guys? Yasuo Sodachi-san and his students. Sodachi-san was my closest confidant when I was champion. And a Sujiman in his own right. Back in those days, I ran a gym, but it sort of... went bust. Thankfully, the Sujiman sensei came to my rescue. I, I can't believe my eyes and ears. I'm here to help him out once more. The Sodachi-san was a master of his dojo. He excels at training and a master to sack back of the nation. for no better ally. So, you're Ichiball's Kasuga. <laughs> Ichiban Kasuga. Oh, shit. Oh. Bad connection. Anyway, have no fear. Bad connection, he's right there. He's in good hands with me. <clears throat> I hate to interrupt, but Kasuga team, everyone's waiting. Would you believe me if I told you this is not the only game within a game that there is going to be in here? Just keep on his 
Is it like that Animal Stay Crossing up. one? Yeah, no, cause you know about that one, huh? Mm-hmm. We'll get to that eventually, I guess. And without further ado, this Sujimon League rookie match is on! The guy doing the tapping with his feet. In Sujimon battles, Ichiban will be put to test as a Sujimon trainer, pitting his team against rivals and creating his Sujimon to attack and do skills. If you advance wisely while keeping an eye on Sujimon's strengths and weaknesses, and you're bound to achieve victory. Let's give it everything we got. Do it up. All right, boys. Charge! Whoa! -ho -ho! Put the kids to bed for this one, or wake them up and make them watch if they're little brats. Oh, looking good, Kazuka's. Oh. <laughs> Guess I got caught up in the moment. Anyway, what the hell do I do now? <laughs> oh, that's you. No, it's Sodachi. Hey, <laughs> worry not. I'm a first rate Echuji man, after all. I'll walk you through the basics. You will? Thanks. Let's do this, Sodachi san. Sweet. Now, the first step is to build up your team's strength. Attack opponently only exhausts a Shuji Mon's stamina. As a trainer, you gotta watch for the moment we're ready to go. For your Shuji Mon attack, they must accumulate Shuji Mon power. Once the SP reaches 10, you can give him a command. The rate at which your team gains SP is determined by the attack to act member's total speed. More movement attack requires SP. Oh, is it like the ATB system in fucking uh, Final Fantasy? Seems like it. Oh yeah, I'm all fired up now. Kazuka said, what should I do? Command Sodashi to perform, perform an attack. Get ready. Ah. Whoa, nice move, Sodashi-san. <laughs> naturally. Brilliant instructions in your part, Kazuka san. When your Shochiman team is ready to roll, that's when you can tell us to attack. Oh, by the way, you don't know that Shujiman have different types. It's <laughs> a great idea to direct us to attack a Shujiman. We've got a type of advantage over. You guys look like you're fighting types. I hope one of them are normal or steel or rock or ice. <laughs> huh, these battles are deeper than I thought. Shujiman are categorized to five types. Blaze, Frost, Nature, Light, and Shadow. These types of advantages and disadvantages against others. If you attack an opposing Sujimon, you have a large type advantage over. You'll do extra damage or more or more MP for special attacks. Understanding the relationships is key to understanding Sujimon. That takes care of the basics anyway. So I commend us for yourself now. But this makes perfect. Okay, I could do this. As Sujimon's position is relative to the enemy, it affects the repair range and power. Attacks aimed dead ahead or stronger while aimed a diagonal or weaker. If you're too far away from the opponent, you won't be able to attack at all. Always take take positioning into account on the field and check the targeting line, see how your attack comes to the enemies. A red line will mean your attack will be super effective. A light, white line needs to face normal damage, and a black line means a type, type disadvantage. Once per turn, you can swap one Sujimon's place another one in the field or reserve. Sujimon can still attack afterwards, but swaps can't be undone in the same turn. Consider the enemy's team position, composition to make every swap count. The next move could be fatal. Here comes it. Ah. Defender, holy shit! The crowd's ready for something big. Considering a pinch hitter, Time maybe. To die. Hey. Ooh, we're on a wall. Looks like we can accomplish anything together, doesn't it? Let's try for this with a big move. Um, sure, do that. Go all out, I guess. Sujimon naturally accumulate morale points and as the battle progresses and the team's enthusiasm grows. Exploiting type advantages and attacking multiple Sujimon at once will accumulate accrue more MP. The more you and your Sujimon care for one another, the faster the meetable charge. Use MP to have Sujimon perform special attacks. Special attacks can deal major damage to the enemies or heal Sujimon on the brink of unconsciousness. Time them well, these powerful skills consume MP, end your turn and empty your SP gauge completely. Wholesome things and 
Don't rule out the roulette. When one of your Sujimai goes for a special attack, cheer them on, they give them a boost. Your support's efficacy is determined by the roulette. Stopping on red makes uh, attacks hit all enemies greatly increase the uh, recovery of healing skills. Green ensures their attacks strike forward and diagonally and slightly increase healing. Letting on blue makes the Sujimai a bit self conscious, reducing their attacks range to only one enemy, increasing Green, the amount they'll heal. Oh, holy shit! <laughs> Get a load of that! What the hell? That was awesome! <laughs> See? As we keep attacking, the team builds morale. That's a chance to make us unleash something nuts. Special moves win special battles. That all about wraps it up, Kazuka san. All that's left to do is celebrate with a commemorative photo. Everybody gather around! The music even sounds like Pokemon. You win. The winner I got some money out of that. The Kasuga team! Oh, we did it! Sweet, sweet victory. Whew. How the hell did we do that? <laughs> well done, my boy. I knew you had what it takes. Knew it in my bones. Huh? And in a certain bone. That guy. That's Professor Morikasa, isn't it? Uh, oh shit, it's really him! The former champion! I thought the Suji League expelled him, didn't they? But he's back now? Or isn't he? How intriguing! The Sujimon League's prodigal champion, Morikasa, has returned! Bugger all. Time to go, Kasuga. Uh, okay, okay. Morikasa-san. <sighs> that got out of hand, Kasuga. I'm sorry. No shit! The hell was all that? <laughs> details here, Sensei. Right, I owe you that. The truth is, I'm the former Suji League champion. Oh, it was a different time. The gambling wasn't so rampant. Back then, the League was a true test of skill. That was the Suji League that I loved. I was proud to be its champion. But since the Suji League committee was established, gambling's devoured the soul of the competition. The Suji League committee? Did you see those folks in the weird pervert masks? That's them. They run the bets and skim off the top of every battle. Gradually, they started fixing matches to accommodate their wealthiest clients. As soon as I heard, I rallied against them. But they were too powerful. They exiled me from the League and claimed total authority. I can't believe all this. Truthfully, my plan for the start <laughs> the feelings the mutual league. make it the place of honor and glory it was before i loved it once my suji league i can't stand seeing it corrupted like this so then god he even looks like shido with a scar there's only one option be the very best become suji league master and win the championship, the championship you're not gonna get reacted as strongly as the first time wins. If one wins the favor of the crowd, they could oust the committee itself. But you said they exiled you before. That's why I need to battle in your place? That's right. <laughs> Please, Kasuka, will you do this for me? Why does it have to be me? What about Sadachi-san here? He's got way more experience than me. Sadachi-san's not a bad trainer, but he's never been popular with the fans. I mean... Doesn't he just have that dull-witted creator wrestler look about him? <laughs> oh, Kasuga, go. You have a knack for Sujiman and charisma to That is a joke I was not expecting at all. I don't know. The committee possesses terrifying wealth, you know. They've ruined the infinite, you might say. This poor Sujiman, all swallowed up by the system, and I 
in the Sujiman Sensei. As I told you before, I seek world peace. Not only for normal folk, however, for my Sujimon brethren as well. I want to break the cycle of mistreatment and exploitation of my kind. I'm asking a lot, I know. But you're the only one who can help. Mm. All right. When you put it like that, I can't just walk away. Kasuga, you're really in? Uh, frankly, I don't understand all the details here, but... I know you're not a bad person, Sensei. If you say this matters to you, I'll help. Kasuga, words fail me. <laughs> Please cast judgment on me. Hey, 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 come on, old man. It's all right. <laughs> but I'm just so happy. <laughs> I always cry when someone else cries. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, they're all anime crying. <laughs> okay, okay. So, for the most part, I get how the Suji League works, but I'll still need more Sujimon, right? Hmm, you'll want three starters and three for the bench. That's at least six in total. A party of six! Ha 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 ha! That's a double my stock, basically. How am I supposed to do that? That's easy. Just smack them around until they give in. Kick them, punch them. Violence takes care of everything. What? Really so matter of fact wrong. about it. Well, his explanation is somewhat crude, but not entirely wrong. Sujiman classically obey those who assert dominance. This will be easier to learn by doing. Oh, it seems there's a raid happening nearby. A oh raid. my fucking god. <laughs> yeah. a spot for strong Sujimon, where they battle one another to establish a native pecking Boy, I hope I have a pass to get in. Go over there and flex. D why? Look, raid dwellers respect strength. They naturally defer to the most gallant among them. If you don't want to flex, find some other way to display your vim and vigor, and then win their hearts. Just start by introducing yourself, all right? Oh, and take some of these. Common Sujimon gift. Gift box that shows your affection. Full of general goods, Sujimon will accept it. Suji gifts. I model them after traditional year-end presents. Didn't your parents give you any as a child? Wait. Right. I'm sorry. Anyway, <laughs> to Sujimon Master Kasuga. I'll give it a shot. Snag a Sujimon from a raid. I can't but fucking believe this shit. You look pretty strong. That's you who's stronger. Raids are a test of strength amongst the powerful increase. You're all looking on top. You have a chance to recruit the feet of Sujimon. Exclusive some special varieties. Note that these are real street fights, not sanctioned Sujimon battles. While participating in a raid, there's a chance of recruiting a bonus raid. There are two types of bonus raids. Reward raids, which grants bonus results, or legendary raids, which give you the opportunity to challenge a legendary Sujimon! <laughs> you reach a raid before the Sujimon appears to use raid. Like, oh, come on. I got pulled into a raid, huh? Island Scrapper! <laughs> oh, missed. Yeah! <laughs> His thighs were vibrating against the window. Okay, I'll ask him to join up. Man. Now's your chance. In Hawaii, some Sujimon might find themselves impressed by Kasuka's strength hanging around after a fight. You use this opportunity to recruit them to your Sujimon team. To convince them to join, you'll need to make it worth their while. First, put your heart in presenting them with a Suji gift, then convey your feelings with a show of sincerity. Probably what you offer affects how genuine your request appears. A well timed gift box can be the key to snaggering a powerful Sujimon. There you go. Take this a peace offering. Are you serious? Are you trying to 
to pay me off. Press X to beg repeatedly. All right, I'll help you out. Shoot him on snack. So instead of trying to catch them with the ball, it's like, here's a gift. Come on, please, come on, come on, please, 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 please. Sujimon, you recruit after battles have already built up a substantial amount of experience from the time in the wild. <laughs> they can be up to immediate help to your party. But if Sujimon seems willing to negotiate after a fight, there's little reason not to recruit them. Oh my god, you have to catch Pokemon in this game now, too. Alright! I caught a Sujimon! Uh, or, or something like that. Da da da! Da 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 da! That's the way! From now on, if a Sujimon hangs around after defeat, try recruiting them to your team. Just remember that not all Sujimon will join you. Consult this list here to see who's eligible. Take a look at it now. All you need to know and then some the Sujimon dossier is automatically updated with the list of recruitable Sujimon you'll encounter in your adventure. It contains helpful details about them as well as unhelpful details. Oh, well, that's but well, don't I also have to help self explanatory. A simple way to improve your Sujimon is to shove some Suji munch down their gullets. What? However, it's better to raise them up in battle. Sushi Munch! Rival trainers in the city. Try taking them on. As you defeat other trainers, your ranking in the league will increase. At a high enough rank, you can even challenge the fearsome discreet <laughs> The current champion, King, sits at the very top of that peak. You'll have to dispatch the rest first. Uh, this is gonna take long, you think? Nah, with me by your side, it'll be a cakewalk. Let's go grind, knock out the four, and then we'll all take a trip to Suji Land. Suji Land? Uh, there, there's not really a Suji Land, right? So don't you say that. One more thing. Let me install the Suji League app on your phone. You should find it quite useful. All right. Guess I'll give it a shot. Thank you, Kasuga. This is it. You must travel across the land, searching far and wide. Oh my God! Man, I'll wait here inside. Uh, are those lyrics? It, it's it's uh, something I've been working on. Uh, forget it. Go catch those mons, Kasuga. Gotta catch them all. Sujimon battles, huh? This is the last thing I expect to get dragged into. But hell, it might be fun. Guess I'll try catching those Sujimon later. Oh, your trainer rank indicates your reputation as a Sujimon trainer. Oh my god. Now uh, it's something. You really do got a thing for Chubba, don't you? Hey, it's not like I go out looking for it. Hey, oh, that's you. Hmm. Well, at least it seems like you had fun. Aw, oh, come on, guys! Anyway, we sh should we start heading over? Probably. Well, we haven't done much shopping. How about we peek around some of the stores here? Hmm? Like there! But that has some stuff. Yeah. Not wrong there. Be smart to stock up for District 5. Once you enter District 5, you'll be unable to return to the city or save your game for some time. Make sure you're fully prepared. Oh, shit. Does that mean we're gonna go in? Aloha. Welcome. A golf club. A ratchet wrench and running clothes. Little spender. Bye bye, uh, lightning bat. Value pack in souls. Collided. Jesus Christ, four hundred forty thousand dollars. Oh my God. Oh, I know what that's for. 
These are for the... So, because I pre-ordered the game, I unlocked two exclusive jobs. Uh, linebacker and tennis player. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Stubbin, you feel like pancakes? And now I've entered Tommy Hero. Oh, what's that, Sergeyman Trainer? You just walked past. <laughs> Did you want me to fight them? Yeah, the this conversation. To pick up customers in front of a pastry shop. No one wants to risk buffing it while lugging around a whole cake. Oh, that's a good point. Which is exactly why I know where all the bakeries are. No idea which are good. You sure? Because we haven't advanced the story at all. <laughs> we get sidetracked by Pokemon. Really opening up. You know, so all the pastry, best pastry shops are. Ah, uh, hey. Hey, your relationship with him improved. That's cool. Go fucking man. Oh, oh, no, 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 hey. Wanted to see uh, the sub stories that were around. Run away from the gang of hooligans. Hey, you ain't going anywhere. Half a. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god, they're like. Your one stop Suji spot. These devices were installed around the Su their Suji spot. Fucking hell, it's Pokemon Go! <laughs> Japanese master ticket. They turned the p parking meters into Pokemon Go stops! Rockathon. Medicine Man! Oh, three in one. Allow me. His name was Washington. Stray hang dog? Yeah. Wait, I can recruit him? Come get some then. There you go. Will this persuade you? Perfect! Really? Trust you though? Alright, I'm in. Shoot him on snap. His name is Jennings. This game. This fucking game. I know. Oh, let's advance the story already. <laughs> Yeah, long. Why you using me? So let's do it. Cool. Let's go. Let's go. Allow me. Let's go. It's over. Here we go. His name was Schwartz. I guess the Schwartz wasn't with him. <laughs> now I already got one of oh, you. Nah, you got him. I don't need box trash. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think next time on the Super Bonus Round, there's no turning back if we go in there. So, uh... The point of no return. No, not, not that soon. Ah, okay. So thank you guys again so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Bye bye. Got a got a something tomorrow. I don't know.